Hello, my name is Addie. Thank you for joining me for this challenging chair flow. It's going to challenge your strength and challenge your balance. I've linked a playlist in the description, so if you'd like to use it, click the link and hit play now. We'll begin in a butterfly pose. So bring the soles of the feet together, knees apart, as you're seated on your mat. We'll drop the hands to our sides, allowing the fingers to graze the earth. And let's begin to find the breath. Noticing the inhales in and out of the nose. allowing the breath to deepen. With each inhale, the crown of the head presses up on the sky, and with each exhale, the hips and the legs and the feet root into the earth. Finding a nice, deep, equal breath. Next, exhale, drop the chin to the chest and begin allowing it to float between the shoulders. Inhaling up and exhaling as it rolls to center. Allow the right ear to reach for the right shoulder. Find some movement in the left hand and wrist. Ah, left hand to stillness. Drop the chin through center. Left ear to the left shoulder and the right hand. Find some movement. Release the right hand to the earth, drop the chin to center, inhale, drawing the gaze to neutral and the shoulders to the ears, squeeze, 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 exhale, release. One more time, inhale, ears to shoulders and squeeze, exhale, release. Inhale, arms sweep overhead, fingertips touch, flip the palms, exhale, send them to the earth. Inhale, reach and rise. Kiss the fingertips, flip the palms. Exhale, radiate. One more time. Inhale, reach. Exhale, tip to the right. Reach those left fingertips overhead. Inhaling, center. Exhale to tip left. Reaching the right fingertips over the head. Inhale, center. Exhale, fold forward. Send the heart towards the toes. When the hands reach the earth, halfway lift with an inhale. And exhale to drop in. Round the shoulders. Let the gravity have the head. Press in with the hands, inhale, walking them back, sliding the hands under the knees, closing them like a book. Drop the hands behind the hips, fingers forward, and let the knees fall to the right and the left. Windshield wiper. Check in with the breath. It's only yoga if the movement and the breath are aligned. So keep them united. Ah, let's bring those legs to stay.
stillness in the center. Cross the ankles, roll over them right through tabletop. Turn the toes under, send the hips high, downward facing dog. A little movement here. Wiggle and stretch. Close the eyes, check in with your dog. Ask it what it means. Let's bring that dog to stillness. Turning the bicep towards the biceps, towards the ears. Heels seek the earth. Inhale the hips high. Exhale. Drop the belly button towards the backbone. Nice strong dog. Bend the knees. Look forward and step to the top of your mat. Inhale to halfway lift. And exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Let's find some sun salutations. Exhaling, hands through the heart. Mountain pose. Inhale to reach. Exhale, fold. Lead with the heart. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Palms down, stepping back to plank pose. Wrists are under the shoulders. We're pressing the earth away, pointing the tailbone towards the heels, and breathing. Breathing's easy here. If it's not, go ahead and drop the knees, but keep that core tight. One more breath. Next, inhale, roll forward on the toes, and as you exhale, lower all the way to your mat, Flip your feet, bring your toes together. Inhale, lift the heart, float the fingers, baby cobra. Take a deep inhale, and as you exhale, root in with the hips, let the cobra rise. Beautiful, palms down, toes under, hips high, downward facing dog. Looking forward, moving forward. With an inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale to rise. Nice, strong, straight back. Exhale, hands through the heart. Find your mountain. Remember, mountain is active. Nice, strong mountain from the soles of the feet to the crown of the head. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold, palms down, stepping back, plank pose. We won't, we won't hold it quite so long this time. Inhale, roll it forward. Exhale, lower all the way to the mat. Press in with the palms, lift the heart. Cobra pose, toes under, hips high, downward facing dog. Looking forward, moving forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reach. Exhale to the mountain. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Palms down, step back. Plank pose. This time, you can lower all the way or halfway. Find your up dog or cobra, up dog, hands and feet only. And then turn the toes under. Send the hips high, downward facing dog. One more breath here. Bending the knees, looking forward, moving forward. Inhale to half lift, flat back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. This time, bend the knees, drop the hips. Find your chair pose. Spending a few moments here in chair, let's 
See how we're doing. Weight is in the heels, wiggle those toes. Scoop out the low belly. In fact, think about recruiting your pelvic floor. So if you're not using that pelvic floor right now, draw it up. Then feel those muscles zip up through the core. Feel a little lighter on the legs and the feet. And we'll fold it forward. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Palms down, stepping back, find your flow. That's hitting the deck, finding your chaturanga, finding your up dog or cobra. Or maybe you just step right back to that downward facing dog and take a few breaths there until we're ready to move forward. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, step the right foot through. Keep all 10 toes forward. Inhale, reach to the sky. Press up pose. Exhale, palms down. Step back. Find your flow. With an inhale, left leg high. Exhale, step that left foot through. Rise up, crescent pose. Activate the pelvic floor, draw it up the core. Reach to the sky. Palms down, step it back, and find your flow. Looking forward, moving forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root to rise. Exhale, find your chair. Being intentional in that chair. Recruit the pelvic floor. Rise up, tighten the core. Shoulder blades to the earth, fingertips to the sky. With an exhale, sweep the arms back, come up on the toes, drinking bird. Inhale to chair, nice strong chair. Exhale, drinking bird. Inhale, chair. Exhale, drinking bird. Inhale, chair. And fold it forward, palms down. Find your flow. Bend the knees. Look forward, move forward. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Exhale, chair. Nice, strong chair. Next exhale, drinking bird. And inhale, chair. Exhale, draw the hands to the heart. Bring the right elbow to the left knee, find a twist. Coming back to chair in the center, shift the weight to the right leg, cross the left ankle over the right leg. Deep inhale. Exhale, left elbow, left ankle. So we're twisting to the right. Inhale, center. Let the left leg slide down the right, widening up. Send the arms out wide. Left arm under the right, eagle arms. Bringing the palms together or the backs of the hands together, thumbs to the third eye. Exhale, release the arms, release the legs, sweep the left leg behind the right, clasp the fingers, release the index, lean right. Inhale, center. Exhale, fold. Step the left foot out, 
Halfway lift and fold. Palms down. Find your flow. Looking forward, moving forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rooting to rise. Exhale, chair. Make it strong. Next exhale, drinking bird. Come up on the toes. Sweep the arms back. Exhale, chair. Next exhale, draw the hands to the heart. Let's find the twist to the right. Inhale, center. Shifting the weight to the left leg. Cross the right ankle over the left knee. And then find the twist towards the left. So the right elbow is going to the right ankle. Back to center. Right leg slips around the left. Send the arms out wide. Right arm under left. Wind them up, eagle arms, thumbs to the third eye. Inhale, grow tall. And breathe. Next exhale, release the arms, release the legs. Right leg behind the left, sweep the arms overhead. Clasp the fingers, release the index, lean left. Big stretch. Inhale, center. Exhale, fold. Step the right foot back. Next to the left. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Palms down. Find your foot. Looking forward, moving forward. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Exhale, chair. Deep inhale. Exhale, drinking bird. Inhale, chair. Exhale, hands to the heart. Deep inhale. Exhale, twist left. Inhale, center. Shift the weight to the right foot. Left ankle crosses right knee. Next exhale, find your twist. Left elbow to the left ankle. Back to center. Left leg slithers around the right. Send the arms out wide. Left arm under right. Wind them up, eagle arms. Thumbs to the third eye, grow tall. Next exhale, release the binds. Step the left foot behind the right, sweep the arms overhead as you inhale. Clasp the fingers, release the index. Exhale, lean right. Inhale, center. Release the hands. Exhale, fold. Step the left foot to meet the right. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Palms down. Take it back. Find your flow. Looking forward, stepping forward. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reach. Exhale, chair. Nice, strong chair. Next exhale, drinking bird. Back to your chair. Exhale, hands to the heart. Find a twist to the right, left elbow, right knee. Back to center, hands are still at the heart. Switch the weight to the left foot. 
Right ankle crosses left knee. Next exhale, find the twist to the left. So the right ankle or right elbow is coming to the right ankle. Back to center. Right leg slips around the left. Maybe the toes catch the calf. Maybe they reach the earth. Send those arms out wide. Right arm under left, wind them up. Eagle pose. Release the binds. Step the right foot behind the left. Inhale, reach the arms overhead. Clasp the fingers, release the index. Let's say Pana Mudra. Exhale to the left. Inhale, center. Exhale, folding forward. Uncross the legs, right foot with the left, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Palms down. Step back. Find your final flow. up on the toes, drop the knees, bring the toes together, heels to, or hips to the heels, and extend the body long, child's pose, brow to the earth. Taking about five nice, deep breaths in child's pose. Feeling the back body swell with each inhale. Feeling the heart sink towards the earth with each exhale. Drawing the palms under the shoulders, pressing into the earth, coming up to tabletop pose. Inhale, drop the belly, shine the heart. Exhale, round the spine, push the earth away. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Find a few more movements just like that, or maybe you add a little side to side or a little circular motion. You decide. Bringing those cats and cows to stillness, resetting the table. Deep inhale. Exhale, find that cat back and then draw the right knee forward, right foot around left knee, right shin down, walk the palms back towards the body, drop the hips between the heels, Gomukhasana. Inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, let's twist to the left. Draw the crown of the head tall with the inhale. Exhale to sink in. Next exhale, release the twist. Take a counter twist, moving to the right. Look over the right shoulder. Come back to center. We'll put one hand in front, one hand behind. Roll yourself forward. Untangle the legs, tabletop pose. Walk the hands back towards the body and rise up on the knees. I like to call this mini mountain, but that's not an official name. So we've got the palms facing forward, grounding in through the knees, the shins, the feet. 
Inhale, reach to the sky. Palms together, exhale, draw them to the heart and look up. Keep the hips over the knees. Looking back, maybe to the ceiling, maybe to the back wall, in this modified camel. Inhale, reach to the sky. Exhale, sweep the hands behind the sacrum. Fingers are pointed down like you were gonna stick them in your pockets. Keep the hips over the knees, leaning back. Another modified camel, different version. Inhale, rise up. This time you can stick with that modified camel or follow me to a full camel. Inhale, reach in the arms to the sky. Sweep the right hand back to reach the heel. Maybe pop up on the toes, bring that heel a little closer. Left hand sweeps back, finds the left heel. Heart high, crown of the head towards the earth. Gaze towards the ceiling or the back wall. Inhale, rise up. And exhale, come back to that tabletop. Palms on the earth, maybe a cat and a cow. Find a little stillness. Deep inhale. Exhale, find the cat back. Draw the left knee forward and then step it around to the right knee. Walk the hands back, dropping the hips between the heels. Go Mukasana. Inhale, reaching to the sky. Exhale, twist to the right. Inhale, tall crown. Exhale, look over the right shoulder. Next, exhale, release the twist. Take the counter twist to the left. So we're twisting, looking over the left shoulder. And release. Just help those legs unfold from one another. And be sure your hips are in the center of the mat. You may need to move. Allow the back body to find the mat. And draw the knees to the chest, hugging them in. Maybe a little side to side movement. Maybe you walk the hips away from the shoulders and the shoulders away from the ears. Taking a few breaths in stillness. Release the legs. Send the arms up between the legs. Catch the big toes with the peace fingers. Open the legs wide for happy baby. This pose can be taken in stillness or with a side-to-side -side rock, or maybe extending one leg long as you fold the other one in tight. Closing the eyes. Taking the movement that your body's asking for. Remembering that a baby doesn't plan its movements. Just move, it just moves. Doing what feels good. Take about three more breaths. Nice and deep and slow. Don't rush them. Express gratitude with each breath. And then when you feel complete, bring the soles of the feet together. Let the knees fall apart. Knife edges of the feet come to the earth for a reclined butterfly. Reaching, maybe you reach the arms out wide. Maybe they're overhead. Maybe they're overhead with bent elbows and the fingertips come together. 
so that the arms and legs mirror one another. Bringing the awareness to the breath. Find yourself enjoying five deep breaths with awareness, with gratitude. In your butterfly pose. When you feel complete, there's no rush. Let the hands slide under the knees, closing them like a book. And then make your way to your Shavasana. Maybe straight from here, the legs extend long, arms reach down your sides. Maybe you take a little movement on the way. It's up to you, it's your body. eventually finding that place where you can let go of the body, let go of the breath, let go of the thinking mind, and just be. And don't worry, next time you hear my voice, I'll be gently awakening. Bringing your awareness to the breath. Noticing its flow in and out of the nose. Where do you feel the breath? Is it at the tip of the nose? In the throat? In the lungs? In the belly? 
just notice. Send the next inhale all the way to the toes and to the fingers and allow them to wiggle with that prana, with that life energy. Draw the energy from the toes, up the legs, from the fingers, draw it through the arms. Feeling it in the torso, rising to the neck. Maybe the head rocks from side to side. As the energy builds, perhaps you take a good morning stretch, reaching the hands overhead, stretching the toes away from the fingertips. Or maybe your energy is calling you to curl into a ball and squeeze. Eventually, Roll the body to one side or the other. Drawing the knees towards the chest. Breathing in gratitude for taking time out for something just for you. When you're ready and not a moment sooner, press in with the palms and help yourself to an upright seat. I thank you so much for practicing with me today, for sharing your love and life. It's been my honor. Until next time, namaste.